Okay. Hey guys, my name is Kevin Vijaya, and this is my artwork for um, DP Visual Arts. First of all, I'm not um, not a very naturally talented um, art person, so I tried learning how to make artworks and expressing my uh, feelings through artworks, and this is the results. My uh, theme overall is dystopian fantasy, where I basically revolve my artworks around exaggerated versions of um, certain concepts that we find today in, um, in our lives. And um, especially for our grade that went through the whole corona thing and having to make artworks at home, it really um, pushed us to go out of our comfort zones and try, for example, new mediums or techniques or whatnot. And for me, I used to be a very huge um, conceptual artist fan. So I would draw a lot of uh, pencil or graphite drawn pictures on, um, on paper. This is one of my first ones. Um, this was inspired by um, a game called Near Automata. And the conceptual artist actually inspired me to draw this type of game illustration that I love. This was one of my first artworks that I drew back in grade 11. And ever since then, my other artworks have been slightly different in that maybe the shading's been better. And as well as that, I started exploring other mediums such as here. Um, as you can tell, I think a lot of you know that this is a robot of some sort. It resembles the robots in Terminator because I'm a very huge um, sci-fi fantasy movie fan. And this was my first time um, trying sculpting. It was, it took a lot of time, but I think that for my first sculpture, it turned out pretty well. I used um, pretty hard clay that sadly can't harden up. So although it's hard, it can still um, be broken or be damaged. There's a lot of improvements that I could have made to this artwork, such as um, the spray paint and the types of clay, but the more are there. Um, once COVID started and we all had to do a lot of artworks at our own homes, I started going into um, photography. So I started doing these half and half artworks where I would have a, photo a photograph on one side and a drawing on the other. This is one of my artworks called Arachnophobia where I tried to display some sort of portrayal of the fear of spiders. So I tried to have a comparison of what other people would see and other people with in, uh, that certain phobia to express maybe how they would feel or how different their view is towards a certain thing than others. Um, final artwork that I wanted to show is this. This is more of a aesthetics type of artwork with um, drawings, of course. Um, this I combined with lighting and space, um, spatial techniques within the photograph. And of course, this lighting had to be the right time and in the right places combined with the artwork. I basically wanted to um, portray how something can turn out so different within two different world conditions and um, basically based on economics or um, anything such as that. This is one of my first artworks um, that included photography, which I was inspired by a lot of artists which use this um, half and half photography to display or portray uh, two different worlds within the same world that we're living in. Those are my highlights.